a musical event, a B&B room or a medical appointment. Booking things online just makes everything easier. And when it comes to making online booking easy, the most trusted name is Fluent Forms. If you can collect all the needed information from an online booking form, there's a lot less to take care of once these people show up at your front desk. And if you use Fluent Forms to design your booking form, you're saving a lot of time on that end as well. Let's create a booking form for your hotel rooms. We start at the Fluent Forms dashboard. Click on Add a new form. Let's take a blank form and transform it into something that's gonna add to your business. We'll start off with the basic information you can't do without. From input fields, we'll add name, email, and phone number fields. Select a field and click on this pencil or go to input customization to edit the labels and its placement, placeholder, etc. Make it required to avoid getting form submissions that are missing crucial information. You also have the option to make sure the email ID and phone number get validated. Next, we need to know about the requirements regarding your rooms. Your best option to collect this information is to use the payment field and the item quantity field. Let's add a form step field so the booking options are on the next page. Now the form's gonna look neat. We'll start with a two-column container. Drag a payment field on the left and an item quantity on the right. We'll rename the payment field and add the room class and for display type, we're choosing checkbox selections. We'll edit the payment item to show the bed size and the tariff. Editing item quantity is easy. Simply rename the label and from the product field mapping, choose the type of room it's for. We want our item quantity fields to show only when a guest selects a room type, so we have set it up using conditional logic. If you don't know how that works, it's super easy and the link to the tutorial is in the description box. Do you allow a limited number of adults per room? You can add that info in the help message section under advanced options. To add more room types easily, simply click here to duplicate the whole container. Now just rename the labels and adjust the item quantity mapping as necessary. How many people are we booking for? Since we want to know the number of adults and children separately, we'll first add a two-column container field. In the two columns, we'll add two numeric fields. Label one as adult and the other as child. Don't forget to edit the error message for your guests to understand. We don't want our customers to check in their 12-year-olds as children. Let's fix that. Under advanced options is the field help message. Let's specify who really qualifies as children. We need to know when they're coming and leaving, so again, a two column container field comes to rescue. Add date fields, this time for arrival and departure. From the field customization option, adjust the date format as per you need. Does your hotel come with a transport service? Offer your guests to choose whether or not they need that with a radio field. If they choose yes, they will also have to choose how many and what kind of transports they require. Since they should only have to input this data if they choose to avail your transport service, we'll add conditional logic to these fields.
the form we have now can collect all the necessary information from your guests for booking their rooms. We will throw in a few additional blocks like asking them to state their allergies and a box for them to add notes. Nowadays, people almost always look for reviews or recommendations before choosing a hotel or B&B. Since businesses usually invest in multiple marketing channels, it helps to find out how your guests found out about you. You can easily pick up that information with a multiple choice field. Your booking form can do more than just booking. Fluent Forms comes with all the fields necessary to collect payment. Since we have already collected all their booking information using the payment fields, we can now easily move on to the payment processing. I want to take the guests to the next page for payment processing, so let's add another form step field. They're gonna click on next and find the payment summary and payment method. You can also add a coupon field. To set it up, go to Global Settings, click on Payment Settings. Here under Coupon, you'll find all the options to edit coupon code, percentage and adding the relevant form. Let's save and preview to check how it looks on the front end. Now it's a perfect booking form. Of course, we always recommend making the best use of our highly customizable forms. So your hotel's name, photo, brand color, logo, literally every branding material can be integrated into your booking form. And there you have it, a booking form both you and your clients are going to enjoy. It's smart, reliable and pretty. We have created an all-rounder booking form that can be used as a template for literally any kind of booking. For example, if you want to use this form for an event registration, you can easily transform this form. As you will need more or less similar information, replace the room class label with seating positions. Instead of number of rooms, Ask for the number of tickets. If it's a one-day event, you can simply remove the date fields. If you're offering food and transport, these fields are gonna come handy in this case as well. Use online booking forms to make things easier for your guests and clients. Use Fluent Forms to make form building super easy for you. Want more nifty videos on WordPress website? Subscribe to WP Manage Ninja.